Welcome to the North Square channel. So I'm going to set the gym up today. I'm going to go through what we're doing, why I'm doing it. This is our container. Made some arrangements to train down here. We've got some kit, got the bars, got some plates around there. Seat, always important. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go through what we intend to get from the channel, why we're doing it. Roll the intro. Packed. got a little time lapse then um, I'll give you a quick tour basically so initially we have got these builders trestles they're rated to about 460 kilogram each um, obviously that's a distributed load but as a budget you know squat racks are just stupid at the moment if you can get them um, so we've got them we're gonna put just obviously it's metal here we're gonna bang some you know, something to wrap it on, just be built kind of on the bar when we're using them for uh, on racking stuff. Uh, we have got a bar. Boom. So that is from Physical Company. Um, never used any of the stuff before, never tried any of the stuff, but had a mate of mine who's got one of these. He seemed pretty happy with it. I thought, why not? It's a good bar. Um, might need changing long term i think just the quality of the um you know, the bearings but i think if we look after it should be cool and yeah so i um, will have a look at the weights a decent selection of weights we've got um these are all 20s number 20s there so we've got six in total a couple sets of 15s didn't have any 10s so we've got uh four fives two there two on the bar we've got fractionals 1.25s two and a halfs and then what I had at home already, nice little one inch adjustable dumbbells. So we've got a few bits of plates for them. Um, might have seen them previously me using them on the Instagram. So yeah, with those, we can do pretty much any of the dumbbell stuff, nice bit of accessories. Um, what else have we got? Oh, two some things to show you. So these need to be filled yet, but um, balance ball. Gotta be done, dodging these. Um, We've got some of these, these are sort of postal sacks, good mate of mine sent over, so we'll get some like plastic inserts, a few bit of them, we'll fill them up with some sand, we can do, you know, shouldering, walking around the uh, on the storage place with them. Got a selection of bands, so as you can see, pretty much a full size of resistance bands. Um, you know, warming up with them, um, various bits, any rehab work we want to do. Uh, trusty broomstick, need one on your weightlifter. Uh, I think that is about it. So, a couple of bits that we probably still need. Um, do some of to do pull-ups on. Might try and use this rope. Okay, because what we do have, see if I can show them to you. These little connectors up here, so they sort of run along the unit or the container and we've got them on the other side as well. So yeah, I'm going to see if I can rig anything up to them, uh, even if that rope, pull myself up on it, even if I'm against all this, see what we can do. Maybe just some bands and just for getting some pull downs, you know, just some budget, whatever, just get that back working. Um, but then obviously we've got lots of bar we've got lots of dumbbell rows now. Um, the other thing I wanted was to get a heavy bag in here. But, you know, I can't really fix into the side. Obviously, it's a container that we're renting. Don't want to do damage in it. So, I was wondering if I could use something to loop into those um, hooks. Um, but, you know, we'll have to see. We'll have to play about on that. Might have to just get another idea eventually. But, yeah, so that is the kit at the moment. One bit I did forget to tell you was the flooring. So, we have got these mats. There. Um, it's two layers. It's eight foot B, four foot, no, six foot, eight foot B, six foot, something like that. Um, 42, no, 22 mil, it's a 44 mil. 
nice and solid. However, there was a slight issue that came with that, and my damn mount just fell off there. Oh well. Uh, a little bit of an issue came with that, and that is actually head clearance, and I'm going to show you why, but I think we'll be okay. So the issue was head clearance, I'll just demonstrate, but I think we're going to be all right. So, I was a little bit worried when I first played about, put the bar on me and I was like, ooh, we're a bit close. But as you can see, we've got about an inch or two. So hopefully that's going to be enough for us to play with. Still work here. Um, don't really want to reduce the mats just because I don't want to damage the floor. But with it being a container, the floor sort of like uh, steel bracing along with the floors we're a bit into is about that far apart. Should be good. We will see, but um, yeah, welcome. Right, so some other little essential bits that I wanted to show you. Um, just kind of just putting them all down there, but the general stuff I train with. Obviously, we've got the shoes. Lovely corner there. I got new shoes. Um, incredible, over half. Got me when I first started getting into weightlifting. Got. The big Ben straps, you know, generally using on pause, hang snatches, just stuff like hands with a bit of dodge, grip, whatever. Um, a custom belt, again, Big Ben products. Need any sort of engraving, any custom work like that, get in touch with the map. Liquid chalk, um, I know I'm pretty pro Big Ben, obviously, the dangled guy, but if you need any liquid chalk, smelling salts, any embroidery work, t shirt printing, anything like that, easy man, get over there. Bit of the old hook grip tape um, and what we have somewhere I have no idea where I've put it I've also got a skipping rope which I need to set up yeah we'll find it I've uh, got a Merc skipping rope speed rope I'm gonna start getting to them double unders start getting some wads in with that kind of thing in get the fitness up right so we're out of the container now it's uh, the morning after so having a bit of an early morning walk taking a lad and so it's kind of fill you on what I intend to do with this channel, what is the purpose of the channel. And really it's to, to document my weightlifting predominantly, my return to competitive weightlifting. I'm fast becoming an old boy and I'll be masters age next year. So I want to start making a run back. I haven't competed for about three and a half years now. I started weightlifting about six years ago. Um got into training, got my strength up, had a pretty bad injury, um, at the time was not able to walk for quite a while, not really able to do much, uh, but we kind of, I'll go through that at some point, I'll go through the rehab, um, but it's kind of to show my my journey, the journey back, I wanted to get to um, you know the British Championships with uh, Masters Weightlifting, improve my fitness, Go through that, get ready to uh, you know do some Muay Thai again. I started training towards uh, an inter club at one point, and uh, maybe some grappling. Won't go into you know any technique stuff really for any of that, but you'll probably see some of my training just because of my amateur. You know, it's not really my place to do that when you've got so you know other guys and other coaches out there. It's so absolutely awesome. But yeah, this channel will get into the Olympic weightlifting, get into the SNC, the things that I aim to coach moving forward, um, always improving my education as I improve that, hopefully be able to share it with you guys. And if we can, I like to kind of go into stuff, you know, as I am a carer myself, um, outside of work, and I think it would be good to touch on those areas and ways we look after ourselves. There's plenty of us about out there, maybe into the mental health aspects of things, into uh, dissociative identity disorder, something that would always be we've been raising a bit more positive light so there we go so that's going to be the channel next time you see me should be on the gpp block getting back under the weight um before we kind of get into a bit of a strength phase so yeah check it out click subscribe hit a like and yeah, check out big ben products you've seen some of the kit he's got check out viking couture 
Um, if you use the code Norse Bay, you'll get 10% off with them, an ambassador for them, a really good group of people. So let's get after it, let's do it. See you on the next vid.